Good morning and very welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware the risk in the future trading. Normally, we start every day, uh, Tuesday to Friday, every single day at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. But uh, I like to start a few minutes before. So in case if there is a signals like yesterday, before 10 o'clock so traders can take advantage of it what we have here we are using the three different automated trading the first one here is your market analyzer you will have a new signal right there in front of you you're very welcome to follow us uh, on uh, on a sim we're not responsible for your trade we're not collecting money we're not collecting emails we're not collecting uh, uh, anything out of you we're just sharing our information for free with you and then you will see the signals come in here uh, then you have the entry and the target as an example right now we have 68 ticks on the es based on the last entry signal total of amount 676 ticks based on the last signal not the whole day and uh, this is your pnl based on the last entry signal and once we hit the target, it says target uh, hit. The same story here on the market analyzer. By the way, we are using the same time frame every single day. The market analyzer is based on one minute, and we use one minute every single day. And this is the automated trading, and uh, we will be explaining how things work. In the same time, I will be in case between those two lines. Uh, I will be calling the trades on an ES, only on the ES, so will not cause any confusion. And I'm going to, today, uh, uh, to whoever want to follow me on those calls with the ES, uh, follow me on the SIM, because I need to test the speed on the traders when I'm calling the trade. When I'm calling a trade on the ES, it's going to be two types of a trade. One, in, one is conservative and one is aggressive. And uh, then if there's any of our members in there, they will uh, let me know. Uh, you follow me on a, uh, on a Skype and you let me know how you're doing with your trade and I can feed you. For the ones like to uh, uh, connect with me, you're very welcome to connect to uh, my Skype. My Skype is BBT, B as a boy, P as a Peter, T as a trade, uh, a trade pro. And, uh, uh, and then you can uh, be uh, uh, connected to my Skype. So this is uh, the one here right now, is the, the market analyzer. The market analyzer with that chart have a three different automated to trade is, a, is, uh, uh, is an ATM, ATM strategy and fully automated. That's mean you don't have to touch anything in it. On this blue market analyzer, you see every day the winning and the losing we do not hide anything uh everything is right in front of you and on this one here we are using the scalper on uh, on the bottom here is the ninja trader controller 8 which is using the third system and this one here it is the swing trading as you see this is uh, the dax nasdaq and all of them right now uh, they are into those trades and we will be covering the scalpers we will be covering the swing trade and we will be covering uh, the, the the signal entry and uh, we will start at 10 o'clock uh, I'm gonna get everything ready and uh, if uh, keep your eye on the signal on the first column and uh, we will be uh, uh, calling those trades for you uh, just if you give me a few minutes, let me set up everything and um, and we'll, uh, we'll start at 10 o'clock. Thank you very much.
Again, uh, I want to welcome everyone, and uh, we will be starting at 10 o'clock uh, to cover. At the same time, I will be calling uh, some uh, trades on the ES, and it will be two different trades. One is conservative, and one it is aggressive. Uh, For the automated trade, uh, you already exit at the target. At the, when you are using the fully automated trade, you will be exiting at the target. But when you are using the, uh, the, the ATM strategy, you have the luxury to, the, to disarm uh, the, the trading stop, or you can put your own buying stop and stay with that trade like what I have done right now. Uh, first, I want to say thank you very much for all the compliments, all the emails we've been getting. And uh, uh, thank you very much. Um, uh, a lot of comments, how we are teaching, uh, good comments. Uh, a lot of traders are start following us. And uh, this is, uh, nobody can do that like what we are doing. Come in and showing everything during the trading hours. Everybody want to do video after the fact at the end of the day and hide whatever they want to hide and they pre-make videos. We are the only company. We are going straight live in front of everybody and you can see uh, everything right in front of you. The good trades, bad trades, good days, bad days. And uh, we're this way we can put all this marketing blackmailing on the side when you don't pay off some people they want to attack you I never thought it, this will happen in this business it happened in this business and um, and I refuse to be blackmailed straightforward to this so and instead we came in live front of everybody and let everybody see our system we've been doing this live every day for the last three months every single day Without a doubt, we have the best performance and where nobody can come out at daytime and show all the instruments like we do and call the trades. Our trades is when I'm calling those trades, normally they are eight out of 10. On a bad day, they are seven out of 10. I'm, I, I'm aiming those trades. So what you see, what you get folks, and it is direct between us and the customers to see what we have and what we do every single day. Uh, I will be uh, trying to find uh, some trades on the ES for you, or we can uh, wait on the new signals. Depends on, on the market movement today. Uh, at the moment, there is nothing uh, I can call a trade uh, except reversals, but it's too early for reversal right now. So I will be sitting on the side uh, and uh, we will be covering some of those trades on the DAX, and it will be my pleasure to... I normally use the one minute. You know, I know there is some other ones they are making more money, but I'm usually using the one minute uh, on the DAX, and uh, my uh, DAX on the one minute uh, today took a lot of trades, actually. I mean, it's not uh, something normally on the swing trading, uh, you can uh, be um, uh, done with the DAX uh, based on one contract or two contracts. But today, uh, it was a chop in the market, and sometimes you will have a chop in the market. And uh, we got some um, a little um, uh, volatility in there, and that's why it caused the DAX to take more than what they're supposed to. Um, uh, the, the system here you see is on the 6,000 uh, has not uh, this one here I want to talk to our members because we are uh, creating a system for our members it's not going to be to the public and um this uh, $6,000 trade there is to this system we will be 
uh, use unto our members. And uh, it says on the market analyzer members. And uh, this is what we have covered on uh, Monday to our members and um, uh, with a, a group, each, each group is uh, five seats. And um, every day I'm gonna be watching you till we set up all the life accounts and everything uh, for uh, what we do uh, privately. So uh, for for the ones we we had uh, uh, private webinars on uh, on Monday, this is the system. It will never be released to the public. Uh, this is the system I was talking about, and uh, what will never be for sale. It will never be for sale. Uh, and uh, this is where. Uh, right now on that system, we have $14,000 based on two contracts and the number of trades. So those here now is on zero. This is the first trade. And this one here, total of the trades are 17 trades on all of them. So this is the ones uh, we are talking about uh, for the members. And um, every day we will be... Um, talking about it on the next webinars and we will update you what's going on. I'm not going to be closing right now on this NASDAQ and um, um, we're going to keep to see how far we can go with this NASDAQ today. Uh, on the ES, folks, I cannot call a trade for you. I, I'll be more than glad uh, to call a trade for you. But uh, if we look, I'm already done with the ES. But if we look on the ES trade, uh, this is uh, the two yellow lines. And those two yellow lines here, that means there is no more short trades. You know, So for now, the ES has already hit the target and has come into this critical area where I don't want to call any more short trades on the ES. I will be calling long trades on the ES. But now, as a way overdue uh, to take a short trade on the ES, uh, it's going to be an extreme high risk trade. Nevertheless, if you want to, I'll be more than glad to call those trades for you. But it's going to be very high risk. And, um, uh, you know, uh, but. Uh, I really not too happy about uh, calling high risk trades, especially in those area with the the with the ES. It is in an area where you should not be uh, trading it anymore. Right now we have, based on the last entry, 1,334 ticks. Based on the last entry signal. So we are, we are looking for uh, a new signals. Uh, it's too late to take action for, for that uh, uh, area right now. Uh, it is extremely late. To, to get in into any uh, calling the trades in this area here. Uh, for the ES traders, uh, I will try to find you uh, when, we'll try to pinpoint where this market it could have a reversal and uh, we will call a reversal, but I cannot call short for you anymore on those. Uh, Nothing is holding the ES at the moment, and there is nothing holding the NASDAQ at the moment. I'm keeping my eye on it, and um, there is nothing 
there is no reversal signals on uh, the ES. I use the Renko bar uh, for uh, trading uh, reversals. And uh, there is a lot of, still a lot of potential uh, to the downside. So I cannot call reversal for you. Neither I'm able uh, to call uh, farther down because if the ones they've been following us, uh, those two yellow lines, they are extremely accurate. And once we get in into those yellow lines, there is no more trades. So we are waiting on the new signal or we're trying to find the first chance we have an open, we will be calling those trades for you. <clears throat> right now, based on the last entry on the ES, uh, we have 107 ticks, we have 471 ticks on the NASDAQ, YM, RTY, and all of them, all of them, except uh, uh, gold is uh, not doing well. This is an extreme uh, night. We have a new signal on the gold, and it is a buy entry, and uh, the price is uh, 1925, and then target is uh, 1195. I'm not trading the gold, so... Uh, and I don't have a chart for the gold, but your entry on the gold, you're very welcome to follow the gold on the on the sim. Is the entry price is 92.5, and the target is uh, 95. Actually, it's very small target. It is different from entry to entry. The targets are not fixed targets. They are totally different from one entry to another. So this is uh, right yeah. now we are. Um, uh, we are, um, this trend is over and uh, we are waiting on a new uh, trend. Uh, for the guys, uh, uh, for our members uh, or anybody uh, have a question, uh, you're very, oh, thank you, sir. Thank you, Lee. And, um, Uh, I don't know, sir, about your firewall on your computer. Not right now, sir. Uh, uh, okay. Some traders, they just don't get it. Uh, I, I cannot uh, support about your firewall, sir, when we are going live. Uh, your system is running. I don't know what is... Um, what has to do with uh, me, the firewall, your system is working. Um, okay, now, I'm not a computer. Um, you need to contact technicians with computers. Um, there is a lot more potential on the NASDAQ and um, you should and the ES. So uh, I really hate to call the trades on the ES right now. It is way overdue. Way overdue. Let's look in the meantime, we will look at the, the NASDAQ on the swing trading. This is a base on one minute swing trading. And um, This is the YM, one minute. I'll show it to you. Uh, the, uh, this is uh, the YM, one minute. And then uh, uh, what we have, NASDAQ and uh, YM. And uh, we'll find you the ES. And uh, this is your ES trade. Right now on the ES, we have 16. 
and this one here is 3, 3, 3, and this one is on the YM, uh, 15, 20. Uh, yes, sure, I will take some Rigo. <laughs> you haven't missed this one, have you? Okay. Um, this is one of our traders. Very nice, Rigo. Very nice. Uh, okay. Okay, there is a gentleman, don't know where we are on the YouTube. Here, yeah, my friend. And uh, uh, for uh, Lee, qu quick question, the current signals. Yes, what it, what it does, because um, a very good question. Uh, we have uh, so many things has not been released on uh, Ninja Trader 8. And um, what we are doing, uh, there is a lot of, uh, a lot more coming in on that system, uh, Lee. We just waiting on a little stability so we don't have to rewrite Ninja Trader 8. We have done it 20 times. I don't want to write it in. So uh, on that system, Lee, uh, there is a dome with a signal. Uh, there is a, um, a, a plug all your uh, data to Excel. And uh, there is so many things still coming out on Ninja Trader 8, we have done the dome, but I have not had chance even to 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 uh, to deal with it yet. And um, uh, there is uh, so when uh, those expiry and everything, because those are when it says expire, uh, those are coming on the dome. Those signals. So uh, this is what I have been wanted to do for many years, Lee, for a trader to just put uh, four or five dome and uh, and uh, take the trade straight out from the dome without looking at the charts anymore. So, and uh, I wanna do it in a very efficient, we already have done it, but uh, the system is big and uh, we need to get, uh, there is a lot of things we have not revealed yet, but maybe if I have a chance, uh, tomorrow I'll show you partial of this dome. Um, I don't think so. I have templates for it right now. I need to make a new template. Uh, but um, there is a lot more coming to that system. What I like about this system, uh, the differently, because on the, this kind of auto trade, if the market moving, the market moving. If the market is not moving, the market is not moving. That's it. Welcome to trading. So what I wanted to, what I like about uh, here is uh, the, the technical side from the pullback re-entry. We can do that even when you are auto trading. You can see things like the fib lines. You can see where's the pullback re-entry. Uh, for a trader, it's very nice to be on an auto trade. And, um, but also it's nice to know what's going on, whether you want to use the system or not. So this one here, you can combine uh, the manual and the auto trade together. And that it is, I find it, it, it can, uh, um, it can give better results. But if you, if you don't want to touch uh, anything in the, in the business here, you just uh, take any, a chart on the swing trading like this one here. And if this market moving, 
you will be out trading any trader has been trading for 10 years or 15 years but if this market not moving today and uh, this is where most of the traders uh, make mistakes uh, when they get up in the morning they don't look at the the market movement what they do they just turn on the auto trade they don't understand that you need to look at the chart for a few minutes to see how this market moving before you turn on the auto trade and uh, during those months as we have showed you that sometimes when we hit the target and uh, we hit in a certain area in the market i say there is no more trades whether you are a manual or automated trading or you are using our auto trade or somebody else auto trade the things is in the market lee um the market don't go one direction and it doesn't make money 24 7. it's like you're sitting on a poker table and when you hit you need to leave so that's why now we are coming out uh, we are in this process i showed it to you guys on friday we are coming out with a system uh probably it's gonna be outrun the scalpers and the swing trading what we have done with it we have uh, implement with it that uh, to cut the story short we have learned for the last eight years from the traders they don't know how to optimize today I have a guy uh, I had to log in twice to his computer he said your auto trade is not working so then I come in and log in and guess what he did not know he needs to activate the auto trade so immediately he thought his auto trade was not working because he did not know that he needs to activate the auto trade uh, when he turned on Ninja Trader. He thought by turning on Ninja Trader, the automatic trades. So this is, uh, how are you gonna teach this guy the optimization where he, he, he don't know how to even activate an auto trade, you know? How are you gonna teach a guy how to optimize if you don't know how, um, if you don't know how to load a chart on Ninja Trader? So not everybody is a, is a wizard with Ninja Trader. So this is, uh, we learned a lot that people cannot optimize. We learned a lot. People don't know how to do the trend and stop. We learned a lot. Uh, people don't know how to do the stop loss. And now this is the last stop. And now we are making a, a new auto trade. You have seen it, Lee, that for a guy don't know or he cannot uh, see uh, when the market is uh, uh, is a flat, so he's not gonna go and hit the wall. We have built some filters in there, already built in filters, where a guy can turn it on, and uh, let me put it this way: prevent him not to go through the wall. You know, so on a chop day, and uh, things is not in, is in alignment, uh, he will be not the auto trade will not be taken trades left and right it will be filtered to higher way in order for this uh, auto trade to take it trades and then when this market is trending it will be taking a lot of trades this is a challenge and um, <coughs> and uh, should be and we will be running it here. Uh, right now, we are uh, also building uh, a new system, like today, um, when um, you are too late to pick up any signal here, uh, uh, which it will be done on uh, Friday, this Friday. And I hope I can share it with uh, my traders on Friday. Uh, I want to test it on Friday. It's coming out on Friday, so it will be released maybe a week or two weeks later. Uh, I will be testing it here uh, on a Friday. And what I wanted to do, if you are late on a signal, I want it. I want to remove everything here, and I'm gonna have it on a clean chart for you guys. And then uh, we built another signal. So can it take an entry? If you are getting up in the morning and you're late on the signal, and then what we are have done to it, we're gonna give you color background on it. So the but so if we are in a trend like now, and you still don't know how to trade FIPS, I have people don't know how to trade FIPS. I have uh, people don't know why we have a news uh, in the in the market. 
I mean, you know, not everybody has uh, been around for a quite time. So uh, this uh, new system we are adding on, on that one, you have the entry signal, the target, and then we're going to add uh, this a new entry so you can take a trade between those two lines or between the pullback re-entry. You can take that trade, and then if you don't know how to exit on a good day like this, very fine. Uh, that system is going to change the background of the color, uh, your your chart background, and that is going to indicate for you to 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 exit uh, the trade. So this is uh, coming on Friday, and I hope we can test it on Friday. And uh, then uh, the the new auto trade should be, uh, we should be running it not next week, but maybe the week after. We will be start running it live here, testing it in front of everybody. And I'm hoping uh, we're going to have a success with it. Uh, it is a straight out of the box success. But now we are uh, going to do the fine tuning, the high time filters and all this. Because also, I don't want uh, the traders to uh, to deal with the tra dummy training stops and all this because they don't work dummy training stop, you know, 12 ticks and 20 ticks training stop. I mean, like, uh, now, why you want to exit out of a trade when uh, it's uh, going to your direction? This is uh, this is a crazy sensing. So uh, we don't want this kind of trading when... Uh, we want to get paid when the market is going to our direction. I will take a new, uh, for a gentleman, there is a new guy here on the Skype. I I, I missed. Bonjour, amigo. Hi, Vito. Uh, there is a gentleman in you here. I cannot find him. For the gen for the gentleman says, uh, can you just get the manual system? What what what, what you mean by that, sir? <clears throat> okay, chief. Um, So we are waiting on um, while we are while, while Fernando. Okay, good morning, sir. Um, while we are waiting, uh, most of them has closed uh, trade for today. We have the ES is still on, and um, the Nasdaq is done. I'm you. I'm. I'm. Uh, uh, the the one minutes. All of them are done. The Nasdaq is finished. And the YM is finished. It's done trading. Good. So we are waiting, folks, on a new signal uh, by entry because we are done with the short entry. And I hope we can have a short entry as soon as possible. Uh, Chief, uh, it's not me. Uh, it is the system here on the first column. Here, you will have the new signal. You can get, you can exit any place you want. I don't, I don't care. But I do not provide the signals. The signals comes in here, and you follow it. There is no uh, none of this conversation. I called the trade twenty minutes ago, thirty minutes ago, and then you follow my trade. No, 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 no. Right in front of you. And if you miss a signal, you can go back with the video and you can see the signals right in front of you. I normally like to call trades in between, and I, those has nothing to do with the auto trade. 
and uh, right now I don't see any trade to call on the ES. The ES is done. Uh, there is no more short trade on the ES. That's why I didn't want to call trades on the ES because now it is such a high risk to call the trades on the ES. So I'm waiting until this market to start turning around and um, either the system or me, I will be more than glad to call uh, uh, the long trade for you. And I'll tell you, this is a manual trade or it is uh, from the... Most, for the ones that don't know that, most of the time, like um, when we came into this yellow lines here between those two yellow lines, I said, I don't want to call a short trade for you because once you enter those yellow lines, uh, we are at the high risk. And is this a day, a day, and uh, you have them on the way up and you have them on the way down. So once this any instruments came into this area here, is no longer valid to take short trade. You can take a short trade and it could be by accident you have 10 ticks. But then you trade one more time and then you lose all the money you made. So once this market enter here, I don't want the, trend, uh, the trader to think because we are handling it uh, as I want to look at this chart like I have not traded before. Uh, I'm doing it because I know I'm, I'm not trying to, to attack anyone. I, I want to look at the chart as I am a handicap. I don't know what, what I'm doing. That's exactly what I wanted to, to do with the auto trades and the, the system. I don't want the trader to make decisions anymore. In our experience, we find out you let the trader make a decision, he's going to flip right on his back. So right now, we are not relying on the, on the trader's experience. I mean, we are expecting you to know how to run Ninja Trader, for God's sake. But I don't want it to rely on the trader to make a decision. We don't want him to make a decision anymore. During those years, we learned that if you let things in the trader's hand, he's going to fall on his head if he don't have enough experience. And for the ones our experience, we don't hear a beep from. So right now on the ES, when it came down here, I don't want it to call short trades anymore because this is a high risk. And I don't want to uh, call on the pullback re-entry right now. I'm just going to wait on the new signal, which probably we will have a new signal very soon. And uh, we will be going to the long side. But the short trade right now, I don't want to touch anything on the short trade uh, at the moment. Um, uh, the, the, the difference between the market analyzer here and the chart. Uh, the target on the, on the market analyzer, you have it entry, target, exit. Very simple, straightforward, forward like an automated trade. When you are using the fully automated to trade, it goes on the entry target, done, over. So if we are looking at the NASDAQ, you have an entry on the NASDAQ, here is your target and it's done, over, like the market analyzer. For the ones that wanted to be a little bit more advanced, they can use the ATM strategy that chart can give you updates on the targets and it can give you re-entry. But if you don't want to deal with the chart, you can stay on the market analyzer, entry, target, exit, done, over with. And this is what, what, what is nice about it. You can go on both of directions. I don't know if this will explain it, Lee. Sometimes, uh, once uh, this market uh, uh, spike, uh, there is not much left. So when we have the market is trending, uh, once the market is over, the market is over. You know, there is. Uh, uh, so sometimes the CL start trending at nine twenty eight. You start at nine thirty, and uh, 
the CL can run 100 takes and there is nothing left on the CL after that. Nothing we can do. We'll come to trade it. We cannot have it every day the same day and it will never be every day the same day. So um, this is part of the trading. We cannot do anything. <laughs> Actually today, early today, uh, doing the European market, the CL was trending beautifully and then uh, start getting a chopped and now start taking I'll show you everything. I don't hide anything. This is uh, the CL today. But we started in a very nice trend. We were about to hit the target. And then we we dived into the chop. And now we are, this is the last trade we are done. And you can see where the chops on the CL. So, and this is the last trade and it is done and over. That's what happened to the CL today. What you see, what you get. If you are interested in the three minutes, the three minutes on the CL was a little bit cleaner. Today, we had a Look, I mean, you start the, the auto trade, one, two, three, it hit really bad. And then when the market start trending, the market start uh, giving you money. I mean, there is nothing, nothing we can do when there is a chop in the market, except uh, I'm counting on this a new auto trade, keep you away from the chop. And this is a very tricky uh, to do. Uh, and it does not require any optimization. And uh, we will be running that auto trade here in front of everybody. We will be testing it here in front of everybody before we even release it to the uh, to our traders. Uh, folks, uh, right now we are waiting on a new signal and uh, we're about to have a new signals. Uh, so please be careful and uh, be patient a little bit, a few more minutes. So we can have uh, new signals in there. And uh, the NASDAQ, once we start crossing that line here, we will be start getting new signals. I'm gonna be quiet for five minutes. And uh, I will be looking for a long entry on the ES very soon. So we can catch the trend from the bottom to the top. Uh, right now, uh, I will be calling uh, a trades very soon on the ES. Uh, just wanted to uh, get a little confirmation on it. So we can maybe call a trades on the ES. But at the moment, okay, we have a new signal, Russell. Entry 1616.2, target 1625. DAX uh, entry is uh, uh, 799, uh, target is uh, 854. So those are the new signals and there is a new signals to start coming out. I believe we called, so those, those the only two I can see right now and the new signals uh, start coming out on the ES NASDAQ. Uh, five minutes, I'll be right back. Thank you.
for uh, the question for the members uh, he asked to see the market analyzer the one uh, for the members none of them has closed position yet and uh, we are up to 16,000 on that and none of them has closed yet on those system uh, the ES I'll be more than glad sir to call the trade for you on an ES I'm, I'm thinking to to go long on the ES but if you are you wanted to scalp the ES I'll be more than glad to to look at the chart and give you some um, entry signal on the ES, the signals, I mean, not the signals, because the signals here, they are auto trade, but I'll be more than glad to uh, give you, uh, uh, call a trade for you. The only thing I'm waiting on the, there is a lot of sales on the ES, but the problem is we've come into this projection and the support line at uh, 28.55, and that I do not like, actually, you know. So it is very tight for short trade, but uh, you're welcome. I can uh, I can call that trade for you if you want me when I'm ready. Uh, just let me look at it for a second, and uh, I'll be more. I still prefer you to take a long, sir, on the ES because the short is over. But um, I'll see if if I find anything and you are light handed. I'll be more than glad to, the market is sideways right now, so uh, I don't want it you to, to jump on anything. The market practically stopped. Uh, to our traders on uh, Ninja Trader uh, 7, and eight, we have it. If you notice, uh, you have a stars. Those stars are an entry. You can also enter those market at the stars. Uh, those uh, the stars they are based on the on the previous uh, uh, highs and lows. They are extremely accurate. Uh, to enter the market on those which uh, I will be covering next Monday. And uh, actually, you can auto trade those on NT7N. I believe also on NT8, you can uh, auto trade those signals. Let me see how many stars we have here. So those stars here, also you can take advantage of them. This is another star. And uh, they are extremely, extremely, uh, they're, they're very good. And uh, we will be uh, covering those uh, on uh, uh, next Monday, absolutely. Tony. Uh, uh, we have one guy say uh, he cannot. Hello? Oh, okay, it's back on. It could be, uh, could be the connection with YouTube. I'm sorry, guys. Can you see it right now, Tony? Okay, I'm still looking for a trade. I don't know what happened, but uh, I'm still looking for a trade. And uh, there is nothing right now, guys. We are on the side. For some reason, we got disconnected for a second. I have no idea, but... Um, Thank <laughs> you. 
the market is uh, sideways, guys. Look, uh, the the Russell 30 year treasury bond, gold, and the DAX, they're not doing well. Yes, the NASDAQ is, uh, it is, this is a NASDAQ, uh, Tony. And uh, the problem is, as long as uh, we are below the 729350, we're not going to get anywhere with this, um, with this market here. It's going to stay on the short side. We cannot, and I'm keeping my eye on the ES, trying to see if it's, um, we can take a short trade on the ES, but we cannot. The reason is we have a projection support line and uh, the, the ES is holding on those numbers here. You see that? And those two yellow lines are the critical area where you should not be taking a short anymore. So I'm having a hard time calling trade for you, Tony, on that one here. If you if you made 255, uh, Tony, uh, that's good. And uh, stay away uh, from the trades right now because the market is just stopped. You know, there is nothing. The ES is holding on this levels here to 855.50 and there is nothing going below that line. And this yellow line right there, uh, there is no way uh, I will let you take a short trade in here. There is no way I will let you take a short. Uh, the same story on the YM. Look, guys, you see those two yellow lines? Uh, it came in the first time, the second time, and the third time. And once the market entered those two yellow lines, you should not be taking a short trade uh, anymore. Uh, let me look at the e uh, CL, even on your CL. Uh, look at this, your CL. So the, the market has all the way to the bottom. And uh, look, you see the CL? We have a double reversal. And it is on those yellow lines right there. You should not be taking a trade anymore. So there is nothing really. Uh, and like yesterday, yesterday we were all over the place. But today there is whoever took those trades earlier today, it did. And who don't, um, you know, we cannot do anything on those. Sorry, guys. We just have to wait. There is nothing I can do. I just don't want to call short trades anymore. Good. Um, protect your profit and uh, don't wait. The market is not moving. Protect your profit. Don't take any trades. There is nothing we can do. I will wait on the new signal, guys. There is nothing I can do. Uh, the market is stopped uh, and uh, it's not getting anywhere. And uh, there is nothing right now. If we take any trades, it's going to be losses. So we just wait on the new signals. Uh, you will find the new signal right there on the first column. And um, I need, I don't, I mean, I cannot do anything really, guys, uh, to call a trade for you. And it is a very high risk uh, to call those trades once uh, they enter the market here. That uh, leave us uh, a little bit handicapped uh, to 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 make anything out of. If you want to, you can take a short trade here, uh, Tony. If follow me on a sim with it, 
you can take a short trade here on the ES, but you have to be very light handed on the ES and um, uh, and uh, it is a very high risk trade on the C uh, on the ES right now. A short trade is extremely high risk because it entered this. Oh, before we we finish talking, look at this. There is some buyers. The market is moving. That's good. So it's already start changing direction. We'll wait for the signal and I'll stay quiet so we will not get in trouble. Uh, there is a new signal on the gold, uh, 9001, target 87.8.
uh, for those uh, guys, uh, our uh, members, uh, this is the system we were talking about. And uh, none of them has closed position. And now it has hit 20,000 on that uh, uh, system we were talking about, uh, which uh, for the live trading. So we will be covering more on uh, Monday also for that account. Thank you, Luma. Uh, this is uh, the one we talked about, uh, the shared account, and um, and today it hit the twenty thousand. So for five people, this is a very good return today. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna leave everything on. Uh, I cannot do anything, guys. So I'm gonna leave everything on, and uh, I'm gonna stay quiet because there is no trades. I cannot call any trades uh, in those conditions here. I don't want to take shorts anymore. I want long. So we are waiting on a new signal. And the market right now, we had a new signal on the gold right now. And uh, we had a signal on the Russell, but they're not going anywhere. The reason is the ES, NASDAQ, Dow Jones is still into the short position. And they're not going anywhere uh, long. I mean, this is uh, the aggravation. Uh, on uh, uh, the trend is over, the party is over before we even start today at 10 o'clock. And like yesterday, the action was at 10 o'clock when we started, but uh, the, it was an early action today. And uh, I cannot call a trade for traders here between those two yellow lines, Zach, because this is a no no area. I mean, this is not, uh, this is a high risk trade. I don't want to call high risk trade. You know, so I'm, I will be staying quiet. Uh, sorry, guys, um, I cannot help you at the moment. So we'll keep our eye on this uh, market. We'll see what we can do.
Okay, guys. Uh, uh, yes, I know, uh, Vito. Those are uh, the system for the members. And uh, uh, right now, based on two contracts, NASDAQ, ESCL, DEX, YM, we are heading 23,000 on those. This was a damn good day on those. Uh, we're still not uh, getting anywhere. The market is uh, down and it's not getting anywhere. So... Based on two contracts, members. This is the system we were talking about. It will never be for the public. Okay. We're going to stay a little bit longer. Oh, this one is not for sale, Tony. We're going to put the members on it, but um, it's not for sale. You will never get it. You don't have enough money to buy it. But we're going to put the members on it. It will never be for sale. For members only. Yes, sir. Uh, we're going to stay a little bit longer, guys. There is a, still a lot of sell-off. And you know, on the signal, the one I told you to go short on it, you just uh, go ahead and uh, refine it and see how many ticks you missed on this one. But um, we are 1,565 ticks into the profit. And what a day. Total amount and it takes 1,592. So we're gonna stay. Uh, maybe we can get the signal around 12. On the, on the CL, one minute. We're still on that trade for 2,320. I mean, the market is down. That's it. Simple as that. And uh, DAX, uh, 10,000. DAX, 10,000. NASDAQ, 7,000. On the swing trading, 7,000, 7,000, 6,000. All of it, NASDAQ. All of it, NASDAQ. Okay, we stay quiet for a while.
Okay, guys, this is all what we have for today. And uh, we couldn't do anything. The signal's already in there. And uh, we are done for today. For our members, uh, this is uh, the members' uh, things we have uh, covered on Monday. And uh, we will be covering it the uh, rest of the week. I want to say thank you very much for today. And God bless you all. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow at 10 o'clock. Bye for now.